Today let's do redemption of debentures by conversion and I'll take up some questions on this. In our previous session, we have already seen the journal entries relating to this conversion of uh, debentures and uh, also how to calculate the number of shares. So now first of all, I'll take up a question, let's say, Two thousand ten percent debentures of rupees hundred each issued at par were redeemable <coughs> at a premium of uh, sorry were redeemable um, <clears throat> okay redeemable at a premium of 10 percent right were converted into equity shares of rupees 10 each at par right give the journal entries for this Now, first of all, the first journal entry is the amount which becomes due to the debenture holders. So, now in this case, it is a 10% debentures. Two thousand debentures of rupees hundred each. So, that is two lakh rupees, right? This is 200, uh, sorry, 2000 into 100. <coughs> then, whatever is the premium on redemption, that will come. Premium on redemption of debentures account debit, right? This will be <coughs> the debentures are redeemable at a premium of 10%, right? So, 10% of rupees 100 is 10 rupees. So, this is basically 20,000 rupees, which is 2000 into 10 rupees, right? To debenture holders account. This amount will be two lakh twenty thousand. This is the amount which is due to the debenture holders. And now <coughs> they are converted into equity shares of rupees ten each at par. Now the debenture holders account debit <coughs> to equity share capital account this is the amount which is to be paid to them so this amount will be converted into equity shares right so here here you need to write only this in the narration you will write being the conversion of 2010% debentures into <coughs> 22,000 equity shares of rupees 10 each issued at par. Now here The number of shares <coughs> will be calculated as two lakh twenty thousand 
divided by 10 which is equal to 22,000 shares. Right? So this is a case when the debentures are redeemable at a premium and they are converted into equity shares at their face value at par. Right? Now I'll take up one more question in which the conversion into equity shares is made at a premium, right? So let's take this. <coughs> Sita Associates redeemed 5,009% debentures of rupees 100 each. Now here let's say issued at par, right? The debentures are issued at par uh, by converting them into equity shares of rupees 10 each issued at a premium of 20% let's say right now here 9% debentures account debit 2 debenture holder account being the amount due <coughs> to the debenture holder. Now this is they redeemed they have uh, they have to redeem five thousand debentures of rupees hundred each. So that is five lakh rupees. <coughs> and now we come to this Debenture holder account debit to equity share capital and these shares are being issued at a premium so you will have two securities premium reserve. <coughs> now see here. First of all, <coughs> let's see. How many shares? Uh, like they will be converting this into how many shares, right? So, the number of shares to be issued will be equal to 5 lakh divided by. Now, they are saying they uh, by converting it into equity shares of rupees 10 each issued at a premium of 20%. So what is uh, 10 into 20%? 10 into 20% is 10 into 20 divided by 100, right? <coughs> so this is rupees right this zero can be cut this zero can be cut here so we are left with two rupees right so two rupees is the premium so basically the issue price of the share is equal to 10 plus 2 that is equal to 12 rupees right now number of shares to be issued will be 5 lakh divided by 12. Five lakh divided by 12 
it comes as a decimal figure yeah let's take it as forty one thousand six sixty six shares or you can take it as forty one thousand six sixty seven shares right there will be a small uh, difference because there is a decimal here uh, now debenture holder account will be 5 lakh only if I take it as 41,667 shares this will come as 41,667 into 10 that is the face value right so 4,16,670 fine and um, Forty one thousand six sixty seven into two. The security premium reserve. <coughs> will be this much <clears throat> it's actually when you do uh, 41,667 into 2 it comes as 83,334 right but uh, due to that uh, decimal uh, like I had got something as 41,666 point some shares which I rounded off to 41,667 right because of that the difference of 4 rupees is coming but we will put securities premium reserve as 83,330 only because the total has to be 5 lakh here right normally in questions like this you won't get a decimal figure so it will be a round figure uh, wherein you will not face this kind of approximation right but in this case since we are getting a decimal figure here we I got it as something like uh, 41,666 point something that's what we got and here uh, when I write 41,667 shares this is just an approximation right the basic thing that you have to understand here is whatever is the amount which is due to the debenture holder that should be divided by the issue price of the share the issue price of the share in this case is since it is issued at a premium this is 10 plus 2 and this 2 rupees will come here right in securities premium reserve and this one will be like this right So we have seen two cases the first one was where the debentures were converted into equity shares of 10 each at par right in that case the entry will be just debenture holders to equity share capital the second one is when they were converted into equity shares and issued at a premium now I'll just make a small change in this question so that this decimal uh, thing goes off let's do something here instead of saying at a premium of 20% uh, if I put this as at a premium of 25% right 25% uh, <coughs> Of rupees 10 will be equal to 2.50 rupees right so in that case the issue price will be 12.50 fine if the issue price is 12.50 
then if I do 5 lakh divided by 12.50 it gives me 40,000 shares now this is a whole figure right so if I take that this will become 40,000 into 10 right so 40,000 into 10 is 4 lakhs okay huh and then this one will be 40,000 into 2.50 which is 1 lakh This is <coughs> 40,000 into 10 and this one is 40,000 into 2.50 okay hmm. so we took this case now right and I calculated the number of shares here and the new figures have been put here understood hmm. This is the change that we made 25 percent right so we have seen two cases of uh, redemption of debentures by conversion in this session i'll take up some more examples in the next session i would end uh, end this session now